Hey guys and welcome to my new YouTube tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make water puddles in Unreal Engine 5. So you have to go to settings, you have to go to plugins, and then in plugins, in the search type model. And then down there you'll find modeling tools editor mode. Unable that and restart Unreal Engine 5. After you restarted Unreal Engine 5, we're gonna have to right click here, add quicksell content, and then I want you to choose any surface you want. I need you to choose three and any three you want, okay? But I already have uh, surfaces downloaded here and I already added them to Unreal Engine 5 on highest quality, uh, but you can choose whatever you want. Now, I don't wanna close this because I really need this after. Uh, I'm just gonna minimize it. And then I am gonna go to um, surf here mega scans and then i'm gonna press here add an asset filter and then i'm gonna go to materials and textures and press on material instance as you can see our three materials are showing now i'm gonna select these three materials hold shift and select them now i just want to tell you something that if you select this material first it's gonna show on the mesh first or if you select this one first, it's gonna show first. So it depends which one you select first, second, and third. It's like layer one, two, and three. And now I'm gonna just go to go back to the uh, bridge. I'm gonna select any material, just any material, and I'm gonna click on these three lines. After you click on these three lines with the selected uh, three surfaces, I'm gonna create material blend. Now what this actually did is if we go to blend materials, we're gonna see that we already have a material instance created. If we double click on this material instance, we're gonna see here use puddle layer. We can check that and that. We can also check the other boxes. The more we check boxes, the more settings will be here. Now, if you click here on search puddle, you can see that our puddle section is available. Now I'm gonna keep that in mind and I'm gonna put this here and I'm gonna start editing and adding puddles. Now I'm gonna go to our modeling tool and I'm gonna press on rectangle. And then before we place our rectangle, I'm gonna press on lit wireframe. We can see we don't have a lot of geometry here. I'm gonna add width 22 depth 22. Now we have some geometry and some good quality. I'm gonna go back to lit. I'm gonna place it somewhere and press complete. We're gonna go and raise this up a little bit. And I'm gonna place my material here. And then now I'm gonna go to our activate mesh paint, paint editing mode. And then I'm gonna press paint and now you can see that we have something showing, right? Before I paint anything, I'm gonna go back and then I'm gonna duplicate this. Now I just want you to know that we cannot use this method on Nanite. I'm gonna go back to our activate mesh paint and then I'm gonna press uh, paint. I'm gonna double click here and put this black. And I'm gonna select, select both, then paint again. And now, if you activate all of these and only keep the blue, you're gonna see that we have puddles. That is really nice. That's really, uh, I mean, we don't have a displacement. Yeah, I know that, uh, but we have puddles. I wanna tell you something before we proceed to the video. So if there is a plane one and you're just like, you know, uh, painting on it and suddenly it's not painting like now, uh, that's a bug from Unreal Engine 5. Uh, I don't know why, but they should fix this. That's why I made a duplicate and this uh, only works on duplicates, I guess. So here it works, here it doesn't. So yeah, I can fix my puddles more by going to strength and decreasing the strength. And if you go here and press like this, 
a little bit, just a little bit. We can see that there are some dry areas and some puddles here, and big puddle here. And now you know how it works. Okay, guys, that's it for our uh, tutorial for puddles. Uh, later in my videos, I will show you how to work on the other channels like the red and green and how to blend it and all this stuff. Thank you for watching. Please uh, don't forget to like the video and have a good day.